What's going on guys? So a few days ago I bought 30 of these worms to fish for those eastern happy cichlids in my last video. There's still probably like 27 of these left in here. Hate for them to go to waste, so I am down on one of my local canals. Going to be doing some micro fishing. Um, the goal would be a new species. I just don't know if there's any new species in here. So there's three different cichlid species. The Salvini is definitely the prettiest. That's the one we're going to be kind of targeting. And maybe we'll get some other fish, maybe some new species. So let's give it a shot. Let's cut one of these guys up and put it on a little hook. All right, so there's the size of our little hook. There's a split shot above it to help with casting. Just gonna drop it straight down by all these rocks. There's mosquito fish that are already all over it. I don't really wanna catch those, at least not to start. So let's hope the split shot can get this worm to the bottom. And there's some other fish down there. Fish on. What do we got? Looks like a juvenile Mayan cichlid, maybe? All right, so we got our first fish. Another cool little thing I picked up is this little photo tank. So should let me show these fish off a little bit better to you guys. I believe this is a juvenile spotted tilapia. Looks a little bit like a Mayan cichlid, but not exactly. Too many bars, also got a little, little spotting on there. Some banding on the tail that Mayans don't. So it looks like our first fish is a juvenile spotted. Got him. Little mosquito fish, fish number two for the day. All right, alrighty, so it is a very slow day, but we did get our second fish, also our second species, a little eastern mosquito fish. So we'll get this guy back, and I might try to find a different spot here, because this spot is not producing too well. All right, so all I did here was move over to the other side of the canal. There's a big peacock right there. I am not going for peacocks, especially not big fish, because this guy would completely annihilate this little Tanago hook. But let's drop this down over here by these rocks, this bridge, and let's see if there's any other fish down there. What do we got? Mosquito fish number two. So this side of the canal looks the same as the other. So no photo tank for this guy, just a quick pick and then we'll get him back. So those little mosquito fish are super aggressive, which isn't anything out of the ordinary, they always are, but what I'm surprised with is that there's not really any other cichlids. We got that one spotted tilapia, but nothing else. There's usually a bunch of Salvinis down here, some Mayans, but none today. Oh, we got one. What is this? Oh yeah, a little Salvini. First one of these guys for the day, so photo tank it is. All right, so first Salvini cichlid for the day. Beautiful colors. These, these guys always look beautiful. Nice yellow, some teal accents. Let me try to turn this guy around. He's a little camera shy, but it is a beautiful little cichlid. So three fish, actually sorry, four fish, three different species, and this is a nice one. All right, not much, not much else going on over on that bridge. Just a whole bunch of mosquito fish going after it. Let me make a cast here. There's a big kind of concrete slab and there's some, um, I think, eel grass over there. So there might be some fish hanging out, hanging out around there. That is a mosquito fish. So third one of these guys for the day.
What do we got? Oh, was it? hold on. All right, let me put this guy in the photo tank because this is a melanistic mosquito fish, my first one ever. All right, so I hope this comes out well on camera. This is just an eastern mosquito fish, but it's got all these sorts of black dots on it. So basically, this is the opposite of being albino. If you're all albino, you're basically white, you lack black pigment. This is melanistic, so they have excess of black pigment. So first one of these I've ever caught, so that is a really cool catch. Oh, fish on. This is a little baby Salvini. So no photo tank, we'll just take a quick pick and we will let this one go. All right, so I just broke off my Tanago and I believe that was my last Tanago. So, I think we're gonna call it on that. All right, so a slightly disappointing ending there, but I wasn't gonna stay out here too long anyway. So not bad for, what was I out here? Pro probably less than an hour. Yeah, about 45 minutes or so. So definitely not too bad of a day. Got three different species, spotted tilapia, which I think is my first spotted tilapia out of this canal, so that's a cool catch. A couple mosquito fish, a couple savinis, and that one uh, melanistic uh, mosquito fish was pretty cool. So hope you guys liked it, and I will see you next time.